So, uh, what? Everything taken care of? No more problems? Huh? Good. Good. My people are looking for signs the Eidolon is on the move. So far, it's quiet. I think he's watching. Time to do something about that. You took the words right out of my mouth, friend. Ha! See, if I get rid of the Eidolon, the cartel makes me a full-fledged boss with my own clan. And all we gotta do is take out one little assassin and his pet corporation. What a fragged deal, huh? Mako said the hunter will take me away from here. I help find the Eidolon, I get off Narshada. Mako said so. If that's the deal Mako made, I'll honor it. Thanks. This means a lot to me. I'll owe you one. Now that's settled, let's get back to the job of driving Eidolon security out of business. One of Eidolon security's slogans is, Your secrets are our secrets. So what if you were to make all those confidential records public? It has potential. Potential? What, you freaking kidding me? Just picture it. Every contract, every shady deal, all the security specs of every single one of the Eidolon's clients at anyone's disposal. Hey, Anuli, what do I pay you for, huh? How do we put Eidolon security's records on the holonet? That's real hard. Eidolon's holonet transceivers are in the network access sector. Heavily guarded. You gotta slice into those to get to their records. But gotta get past these encryption programs first. You need Z's codes, from him. Also a top-notch slicer to access Eidolon's network. Z's a Bith engineer, best holonet security expert money can buy. He won't just give you those codes. Where do I find Z? Z's currently consulting for a Republic company called Nebula Communications. I'd suggest you blast your way into Nebula's corporate office in the industrial sector, grab some security slug, force him to tell you where Z's at. Who are you? Why are you doing this? We don't keep a lot of credits here. Just take a couple of deep breaths and tell me where Z is. The Holonet security guy? Is he in trouble? I've got a gun at your face and you want details? Right. What am I saying? Z's at the Imperial Spaceport. He's on his way to Mechas 3 for a business meeting. He's probably already gone. I gave you what you wanted. You're not gonna kill me, are you? No, of course not. What do I look like, a maniac? Thank you. Thank you so much. He's gonna talk back. Do I have the correct man? Security expert Z? He's got the chief. I just need the codes to Eidolon Security's encryption programs. I'm quite eager to meet the Eidolon. Will you keep quiet about our little chat? With a little good fortune, maybe the Eidolon will die before he gets to you. I'm back with Z's codes. Ha! Wish I could have seen the look on Z's face. Anuli, we good? Everything looks legit. Beautiful work. Z's code is like music. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let, uh, yeah. Isolate the ones we'll need and hand the pad back to our hunter friend here. Eidolon Security's transceiver codes are marked. 
Easy to spot. They'll disable the encryption programs. No problem. Why did I need these codes again? They're going to get you access to all of Eidolon Security's confidential files. Once we get those, the Eidolon's personal business will be everybody's business. <laughs> Eat that, you ganks! <laughs> okay, so on to phase two of our plan to scrag Eidolon Security's rep and drive their clients away. Anuli? Gotta access Eidolon Security's data transceivers. Input these codes, then slice into Eidolon's network, download their files. Here's a holonet transmitter. Once you've accessed Eidolon's network, put this on the transceiver. It'll let Anuli upload the file straight to the holonet. Eidolon Security's entire database is on the holonet. That's bad. Real bad. For them. The transceivers are in the network access sector. Security's gonna be tight. And the Eidolon will have his best men protecting those transceivers. Feel free to kill as many as you want. 